Those horses, I don't figure losing them to a rustler or some renegade Indy. Milo, don't go out there. weeks they were married. Eight years Milo Jackson has searched. Eight years she might be better off dead. Never did I imagine that an old Paiute woman would put the locket of Jessica Jackson into my hand. That doesn't prove she's alive. This man's search. It's an obsession. I think she must have been one of those rare creatures, a perfect wife, if such a myth exists. I went to the camp, mon ami. And though I did not see her, I was told of a white woman living there. All right, come out of there. Slow and easy. <laughs> it is our employer. You see, monsieur, it is as I've told you. This man Tate has the ears of a mountain lion. I'm a businessman. I like to know what I'm buying. I don't like Tess. I never hired a gunfighter before, I never had to. But I can't afford to take chances with the biggest trade of my life. Two wagons out there loaded with goods. Ransom settlement that the row arranged with the Paiutes. The winter, it was long and hard. They are much in need. Two wagons driven by two men deep into Paiute country. I need a gun to cover my back in case of a trick. It's a big risk to ask another man to take. $500 now, same again when you get my wife back, safe. And if the woman isn't your wife? We'll bring her out no matter who she is. It's your money. We'll stop back here at the post and leave the wagons before we go back into town. Let's roll. We'll be leaving now, ma'am. Well, good luck to you, Mr. Jackson. Bon petit sou. Bring her back safely, Mr. Jackson. Don't worry, or we'll go fine. <laughs> I hope 
off that thread well, eh? Take as long checking a load as LaRoe. Seems satisfied. The man speaks true. What he promises, he brings. It is good. Not to him. In the council of the Paiute, the voice of many is the voice of all. Take the woman. You were dead. When they took me, the post was on fire. All these years, I thought you were dead. Jessica? Which one? You want to get her out of here alive? Over now, ma'am. You'll be home soon. The boy can ride with me. Monsieur, you have success just as we thought you would. I give you my hand. Oh, you poor little soul. It must have been a nightmare. But why are you talking? They are tired. Take them inside. Mm. 
My, after what you've been eating, I guess you're hungry for the taste of real cooking again. Uh, yes. It's, uh, it's very kind of you to go to so much trouble. Oh, yes. Very kind. <laughs> As for me, my mouth is already beginning to water. You are the best cook in all the land, mon petit chou. Oh, go along with you, Frenchman. <laughs> now, first off, we'll get you a nice hot bath and get rid of these heathen clothes. Mr. Jackson here brought you some nice new ones from town. I'll take care of the boy. He's a cute little fella. What's his name? Wavoka. Well, that's a pirate name. Of course, the way he favors his pa here, it'll soon be changed to Junior. Come along, dear. Come on, son. Let's wash up for dinner. Mmm. Chavereux. That mon petit chou is French for tasty. My apologies, Mrs. Leroux. My son seems to have the manners of a savage. Oh, I reckon the poor little tyke just ain't used to our well, you way. better start getting used to things right now. Eat. Some things you never get used to, like, like greens. You heard me, boy. You'll sit there till you eat all of it. The boy hasn't eaten anything but Indian food. You force him, he's liable to get sick. Milo, I'm sorry. It'll work out. Looking at him, people couldn't tell. It'll work out. It'll be like it was before. Milo, you, you have to know me the way I am. Good morning, ma'am. How's the boy? He's better. I saw the light when you were up with him. We're not going back to town yet. We'll stay on at the post a while. Till some of the, the Indian ways rub off. No reason for you to stay on. I'll pay you off. You pull out. It's a long way from here to town. I'll see the job through. Suit yourself. Maybe you can teach the boy some manners. He seems to have taken a fancy to you. He's a fine boy. Find this cuisine more to your taste, eh, mon petit? You won't shame Mr. Jackson tonight, thanks to you. The young find a way to fit in. Yes, the young. You will too, ma'am. Just take it a day at a time. My son. A bargain was made. The decision of the council, not of my heart. The man lives, and by the law of my people, she is no longer my wife. Your wife? A lodge without sons is a lonely place. There will be other sons. Until the shadow goes from my body. My lodge will hold no other woman. Take the boy. No! The boy stays with her. Try to take him, someone's bound to get hurt. Maybe your son. I think you would not take that chance. I cannot hold a bird that has flown away. 
But perhaps my son will choose to be at his father's side. Tomorrow night, I will come again. Try to take him, I'll have to stop you. I will come. I'm going out to pick some berries. Second bottle. He has taken no food all day. Well, it's enough to drive a man to drink, if you ask me. Pretty good for a little fellow. How old are you, boy? How old? We have six winters. Yesterday I saw many berries. I will show you. Thank you. I'm sure that I can find them by myself. Have I done something wrong? Not you, son. Mrs. Leroux, don't do this. He's no different today than he was yesterday. Yesterday I was in ignorance of what he is. He's a child, that's all. I lost a brother about his age in an Indian raid. I'll never forget it. The Paiute women have lost brothers and sons and husbands. But in the camp of the Paiute, he is just another child. Well, then that's where he belongs. pattern of it. I saw a place yesterday where the fish are fat and still hungry. Let's go see if they'll bite. Marlo, what do you expect A decent of me? woman would have shown some shame. For what I did to you, I'm sorry. But I did not do a shameful thing. I thought you liked your men, savage. Stop torturing yourself. You said you thought I was dead. But you found consolation? dangerous to have as an enemy. I did that to him. He did it to himself. I killed something. A dream he lived for. If he's a man, he'll take the broken pieces and put the dream together again. If he doesn't, he's a fool. Well, Volker's well, father will be here soon. He'll try to stop him. I'll try. There will be bloodshed. You won't like that. 
No, I won't like it. Whichever way it goes, it's my fault. Blood on my hand. Jackson's argument. Oh, there was just some other way. Some answer. Answers in here. I found a few just by opening it at random. the young chief come closer. I have come alone. I'm alone. Then hear me. And tell her what you hear. All day and all night I have fasted in the manner of my people. And the spirits have spoken to me in my dreams. The boy must stay where his mother stays. The white man's ways can give him more than my way. white man's ways cannot replace the love of his father. It is in this that he will grow wise and strong. Take him. My place is here. Jessica! She's not going back to that! I'll kill him both! Jackson! Don't look back. By the laws of his people, you're still his wife. It's over now. As long as he lived, there would have been no peace. For him or them. Treat me not to leave you or return from following you. For whither thou goest, I will go. And whither thou lodgest, I will lodge. Your people shall be my people. Thank you.